climate activism is not our hobby. Climate activism is not something that we chose to do. Climate activism is our way of life. As consumers has significantly changed. Personally, I don't shop as much as I used to. I don't know if your sales reflect that, but we're not purchasing as much. We're building stuff ourselves. We're sharing with our friends. One, no more fossil fuels. Two, a just transition for workers and for people of color who, like Olivia say, was saying, uh, bear the brunt of the climate crisis. And three, it was to hold polluters accountable. Being a person in a position of power, you have the responsibility to act for our well-being. You may not be a person in government, but the way that you conduct your business, um, the, where you source your products, that is your responsibility. As a business leader, I am positively impacting my community. That means I need to learn about race in the workplace. I need to learn about gender in the workplace. I need to know my environmental responsibilities when I go out and create products. We are going to reevaluate our ways of life. We're going to be 100% of the future. The youth are only 20% of the present, but we are here and we're here to stay and we are here to demand action and we're here to disrupt. To me, I want to learn from you guys as well. I want to see how you guys change and adapt to our sustainable message. It's so important that we recognize everything that is working toward this goal, that it is a wave and people our age want to see it. You have a moral imperative to do it. You have entire communities that you see on your television screens all the time who need you to act. But if you walk away from today thinking I can do it, thinking I have the power of influencing my business in a different way, if you do it from a place of love, trust me, you'll succeed because we are behind you. Millions of youth are behind you. We will trust that you are going to do this and you can trust us to keep pushing. You can trust us to not go away and we won't.